Hey guys, I'll, today I will be showing you how to do a citadel of laptop splitting. Um, this is kind of a long citadel. It took me like around 30 minutes last time. I think 33. I don't know. But anyways, um, let's start. Yeah, let's get started. So, um, to be honest, the first floor is pretty easy. It's also very short. Alright, um, make sure to jump, like, when you, when you go on this pushing platform, because you'll end up doing that. And, and, unless if you... Unless, but, I mean, if you use bullet coil and, like, don't, if you use bullet coil and, like, uh, do this, then jump, you could just, um, reach, reach, um, there to that platform. Okay, you know what I mean. Alright. Um, so make sure, um, if it doesn't let you, like, go up here, so, you shift lock, or first person, and then hold A and W, and that's how you get up, basically, that's how you get up, um, very easily. So um, now we're almost um getting to an outside section on on the next floor, and there's a skip right there. Like basically, you can go sideways, but you can just go to the normal way too. And you have to go on that tie rope. And here's the outside section right here. Alright, and there's a spinning kill break. Don't stay out there for too long. Uh, or, if you jump like over it a lot, um, I still recommend actually not staying there too long, otherwise you'll die. Oh, this is my new friend, uh, Swag Boy. He got past me in the difficult tower lobby, but he he doesn't got more towers than me in this game, I guess. I mean, this is the first this is the first time um, I seen him in the tower game with me, so yeah, I think it's the first time. Oh gosh! All right, um, I recommend using shift lock like this right here. Otherwise, you, otherwise there could be a chance you can fall. And now um, you gotta press all oh. 10 buttons to uh, progress to the next floor. But there is a wall hop shortcut. Like, if you press 9 buttons, you can basically skip to the next floor. But, I'm gonna show you the normal way. So, make sure, um... Make sure not to fall on one of these platforms because they wobble. I'm talking about those ones. And this is a swinging platform. Watch out for that. But there's a very, but there's a little chance of falling there to be honest. Oops, I'm not gonna do that shortcut. I'm gonna show you guys the normal way instead. All right. Now I'm gonna go up here. Go up here. I know it just looks like a normal roof, but you can actually go through there. Alright, um, if I jump, if I tried to jump in there, I would have fell. So, let's just wait for that to come back again, that moving cup or something. Alright. So you gotta do all five challenges, and there's, uh, five buttons at all challenges. I mean... There's one but button at each challenge. Actually, not the last one, I think. 
There's two buttons at the last one, I think. Um, be right back, guys. All right, guys. I'm, I'm back. Let's continue. All right, graphics. Um, these are not button activated pushing platforms, so you don't have to worry about that. But you gotta jump sideways here or shift. There's a chance falling, like if you go too much in the middle, or like too much off, too much like not in the side. You gotta go to the side and jump sideways. The hold up, let me turn high graphics on. Bro, now I'm lagging. All right, um, here's um a shortcut you can do. It's almost invisible, but it's a shortcut. It's a shortcut that's trusted. You can't fall there, or if you just walk off and you're completely stupid. Why would someone use bullet coil on uh, even the tower? One minute. That's actually trash, to be honest. But no, no offense. I mean, that's not a good time. All right, here's the last challenge I was talking about. Two buttons. Um, here's a shortcut to get here to this button. Or you can just go up there if. Or you can just go up there if you actually don't know that shortcut. I mean, if you didn't know that shortcut, probably some people would go up there. Oops. Oh my god. GGIS for that person. The basement. Alright, the basement will be like, the basement will be like, um, almost getting to 4-7, you know what I mean. Alright, oh, alright, you will see. Um, so basically you'll have to do another challenge soon. Wait, never mind. Yeah, you'll have to do another challenge soon. So um, now um you gotta go here. Don't go up there. You have to go behind the truss. Then climb. Um I know you can just um basically flip to skip some parts. But I'm in there at the truss, but I'm not gonna do that. Alright, that's what I was talking about. You can basically just walk up there, up there, but I'm gonna show you the normal way. I gotta do it on this little basically widget. Pro, I mean, I already use some shortcuts. I'm just gonna use some shortcuts that are useful. Like, not not the really hard shortcuts. You know, yeah. Not the really hard shortcuts. So basically, now, you gotta jump all the way down here, then um, climb this whole truss, and you'll be at the next floor. And here we are at 4-6. Um, that's a moving platform. I recommend going off the edge like that, like I just did. So, um, you don't fall right at the wall when it hits it. Don't fall here. I think these are like half stud jumps in the wall. I think. But now, um, sometimes this would get stuck, but I think they fixed that bug, I don't know. Uh, hold up guys, be right back. Again.
Alright guys, I'm going back. Sorry I was AFK again. I might be AFK again. And I'm sorry about that if I am. So I'm... That... Those platforms wobble too. Watch out. Some of those do. Like kind of the end ones. Alright. Now I recommend jumping sideways here. Do not jump here. If you're using the bullet coil. Don't use the bullet coil on that part if you're using it. Alright, so you gotta press that button. I already got this little left off splitting secret, I think, but it, it, this is not about that. So I'm basically, um, you have to go down here and you gotta do another challenge. And that button was to activate something on 4-4. Well, we're not actually going to 4-4 again. We're doing something at 4-4. We'll see. So um, this will give you speed, then you gotta go here, and if you were wondering what that path was, well, it's here. Then you gotta go on the zip line right here, and the button at the beginning of the challenge, um, those were to activate these winning platforms. Then here's the speed remover, and you gotta go to another pushing platform. I recommend just waiting here until a moving the moving platform comes. Uh, there. It's because of that's conveyor. And I accidentally fell. Let me get that speed again. Alright, speed room over. Let's just wait until the moving platform comes again. I, I failed her because I'm bad. And that's a conveyor right there, like I just said. And here's the button to complete the challenge. Basically, um, that does an instant kill, of course. I don't think there's any instant kill risk in this, um, Citadel. Actually, I don't know. Just kidding. I don't think there is. But now, um, you gotta go down here. If you miss the button, just walk there, and it'll teleport you back to the top. And that that's what the button was for, to go down here. And now we're in the basement. So basically, you gotta complete the basement to get the 4-7. This is under 4-1, I think. But I don't think there's a way to get to the basement, like... Uh, I meant at 4 1 or something. I don't think there's any cheats to get there. Um. Alright. Now here's some half studs again and a spinning kill brick. You'll have to survive that. I accidentally clipped my crystal. The crystal egg is to heal all of your health. And I accidentally clipped that. I could have used that for something. But I don't think I'll use it. I don't think I'll need to use it. It doesn't count as a boost item. It's from the arcade event in zone 2. You gotta do 10 steeples um, to get it. And the arcade event is still out there. So you gotta complete like Tower of Un Unhorted Discovery Zone. I forgot the name. But you gotta complete T O U D for the short name. And then you gotta rejoin. Okay, just watch that tutorial like if you don't know what I'm saying. Wait, um my friend just joined. Is he finally gonna play Jubar's Towers Effect again? Oh my gosh. I'ma use the helicopter power powers to not um get damage if I'm on that kill brick bro that was my old name just because my um bro okay those were trash names my oldest name was just because my friend my cousin's had it I think I think my cousin told me um they had that name but I don't think they actually did Bro, I, I hate those names now. 
this name is good enough for now, but the list is just cringe. One person said that in my YouTube server. Um, it's because um, my friend had a list in his name. Um, Avi List. And I just, um, did a list in my name too. But I didn't know it was Ist. I suck at this, to be honest. Um, this, um, spinner is RNG, so... You gotta do that, basically. Yeah, it's RNG. It's a dumb spinner, to be honest. I feel the easiest jump there. Alright, half studs in the wall again. And you completed the basement. All you have to do is just this now. I mean, not just that. But then you gotta do the backyard of Citadel all that half spinning. Then, um... You can get to 4-7. The backyard is pretty short, so don't worry. You'll see what I'm talking about backyard. Oh yeah, the black one is not there yet. Let's just wait for it. Alright, here it is. Wee, it launched me up. Alright, now... I, th I think there was like a button to activate this to open. But don't try to like laugh go up out of here. Because you're not gonna be able like to get the 4-7. Unless you do like a glitch very fast. But I think it'll kick you. Like at the end. At the one pad, I don't know. So I'm basically don't try that. Okay, I use I, I could have used the crystal for this part. Actually I can do this heal right here. I'm only using a healing item too. This healing item. This is a game pass. Why am I saying too much stuff? It's called Trail Mix of Heck. But we're all healed up now. So I'm going to that pushing platform. And now we'll go up here. You gotta wait for something. Like, you see that thing right there? That's what you gotta wait for. And if you don't press like the button, and if you try the lap clip and complete the backyard, it won't let you in there. Like I said, or if you do a glitch. I don't know. But like I said, it'll kick you also, I think. Um, there's a shortcut. And here we are at 4-7. There is a shortcut at the red floor. Like, I think that's at 4... Oh, 4-12, I think. Alright, so I'll basically just corner up out there. There's a shortcut, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm not even gonna do the shortcut, the red 4 too. There is another part of 4-1. Basically, then um, you have to get a balloon to get back to uh, the red 4. Okay, you will see what I mean. But there is a shortcut to get to the blue 4. Alright, so basically, if you're confused, you have to, t I mean, you have to go here, then go back. And you'll, um, and you'll see this platform, and that's the button to activate the swinging, swinging platforms. I think that's a glitch. Oh wait, this was the guy who was exploding, not lying. Um, basically there's a huge, um, there's a huge skip here, but I'm not gonna do it. 
I basically just let him go sideways. So like not fall. I recommend actually going sideways on this. Otherwise you might fall if you go forwards. And if you're not listening, you'll see what's gonna happen. Is he patient? Is he patient for real? Is he- is this- is James actually patient? Bro, I'm gonna just- I'm gonna say- I'm gonna actually admit it. He's not patient. He's actually impatient. He's also kind of a beggar, no offense. I forgot where I met him, but I don't know. Alright. And after you do that, go there. You know what, be right back. I'm gonna just get water. I'm gonna get water, yeah. Alright, I'm back in. Sorry, um, that took kind of long because, I mean, not long, but kind of, a little bit, actually, a tiny bit. It's because I was doing something also. But anyways, um, let's continue for it. So um, you gotta do this whole challenge um to get to four nine. Yeah. Also, if you go past this red line, um, it will basically um deactivate your time. If you have one hundred and forty seconds to do this. Um, if you don't have enough time, climb up that ladder. If you fall like at a little time, or if you have very little time and um it's about to deactivate, you know what I mean. You can do that or just climb up that ladder. But I don't recommend doing that. It's a better way, pretty much. So um here's um a speed booster. You have to go up here. And if you don't know this glitch, just do this. And boom. And then that will deactivate that your time at that red line. And now you're at the next floor. You're at four nine. Um, if you're doing the secret ending, it'll give you the buff version and give you a splashy dance clue there. But here you got a wall hop. If you don't know how to wall hop, well, rest in peace, you. Bro, I gotta admit it, he's a beggar. I gotta actually admit it. Bro, stop. He's saying add me now. Okay, um, I just fell to 4 8. Oh my god. I'm 
I'm not adding him. Bro. I'm not adding him right now. This guy is a beggar. I just did a glitch on to remove your legs, but actually they're invisible. I'm bad. I keep falling on 4 8. Um. Let me drink some water. All right. So we gotta do this challenge all over again back to get back to four nine. Yo, chill. That's a fun. This is a family friendly channel. Yo, chill. You know what I mean by family friendly, like, with no swords and stuff, you know. Oh, I just failed. Yeah. I'm gonna add board to that part. I don't want to uh, any get bypass words and he any rage I think. All right, finally he won't have to actually beg me um to add him on Discord. Since his Discord account got hacked. For real bro. I just I just hate I, I just hate when people beg me. It's so annoying. I used to be a beggar, but now I'm not. I noticed how annoying it is to people. And I'm not doing that anymore. Bro, it just made me skip those wall hops. What the? Well, those wall hops are very easy anyway. Alright, looks like we're about to get to 4.10. And we're at 4.10. He said what tower? Say it all laptop splitting. I just did a glitch there um, to get up the ladder fast. You can't do that with normal trusses.
wait, I didn't know I spelled again wrong. Um, so now um, you gotta do um, three challenges. You gotta do three challenges to progress. I hope I get to 100. Like for real. I don't know how Red even got over a 100. He, he barely edited his videos. Barely. I'm talking. Barely. Barely. But whatever. So don't touch the kill breast when you press the button. Because that's what happens. Oops. I am so bad. Alright, um, that's why the park goers here. And here's, um, a good skip. Right there. Actually, you can just do that too. Bro, this person is saying I'm hacked when I beat Tower of Difficulty chart, but when it was not revamped. It is revamped, but you can still go in a classic portal. You have to go into a four tile, like, around Tower of Difficulty chart, but not in, not in, like, the revamped portal, you know what I mean. Oops, I forgot. You have to go, you have to go to the next area of the moving platform. Like, you have to go in the moving platform again to that challenge. Alright, um, it gives you 30 seconds for the speed, um, so don't fall. Like, I'm top, like, for real. Don't fall. Or, like, or, like, don't be too slow. Alright, um... Alright, now we're at 411. Alright, um, so you can go back there if you fall on the kill bricks. I'm not really speaking now because of all that information I told about stuff, you know what I mean. And I'm kind of tired of talking right now. Um, here's some small tide ropes. Um, just a boy falling there.
Wolf. Or a um four twelve I guess. This guy does this guy thinks Tower of the Lodge Nicket runs doesn't exist. AKA the hardest tower in the game. No I felt the four eight. Wow. I, this is the worst video ever. Yay! Worst video ever. Nice. The worst little laptop splitting video ever. Yay! Bro, I, I might jinx myself. Actually, I don't know. For real, like, he has to stop using bullet coil. Bullet coil actually makes him more bad, for real. Not even flexing. What the? For real. All right, four, um, ten again. It looks like this is the worst sale a laptop splitting video ever.
For real, who keeps? Bro, this is a bad zero laptop splitting video. I feel literally at the easiest jump there. All right, this jump, um, there's a chance of fill in there. All right, and I recommend doing this. Don't go forwards. Or you can just go sideways.
bro. Right. So, um, when you complete this floor, you can um almost get to the next floor. Very close. All right, you gotta do this part now. do to skip to the blue floor so basically you just gotta go all the way up here I don't know why I said nice all right we're at blue now That's non collide, so make sure to jump there sideways. I just recommend jumping sideways. Like, otherwise, you might fall. Um, here's a conveyor. Um, don't fall there. And now, um, you gotta go there, and it turns dark. You can high jump there, but I'm not going to do that. Alright, also, there's a chance of that conveyor flinging you out of the tower, so avoid, um... Avoid, um, avoid touching to convey, I meant avoid, like, going on to, on the conveyor. Yeah, there's a chance of, of it pushing you out of the tower. I meant out of the citadel. Alright, so go on the pushing platforms or like that. Alright, so do these wraps. Well, can you use that as a head hitter? I don't know. I think you can high jump that. Actually, I don't know. Okay, I'm actually scared now, but you gotta do these. You gotta do this wrap. Do these tight ropes um, to get to the button to the second last floor. And that's the button. You gotta go back now. You know what, what I recommend doing here? That. I know it'll look scary a bit. If you're like... If you're like, um... Like, kinda new to your first hands effect and you got there. Uh, or I don't know. And second last floor time.
Oh my god. Alright. Bro, I'm gonna die. Never mind. Alright, um, you'll... I meant... If you, like, touch the kill right here, um... You'll be teleported to the beginning of this floor. So, um, don't touch that. Make sure to go on this platform right here. Um, you'll lose progress here. Um, yeah. So don't head, don't touch these kill bricks. I don't recommend that. I meant, if you touch the kill brick on the ground, you'll be teleported back to the conveyor part on this floor. But if you touch the red kill brick, you'll be teleported to the beginning of this floor. So don't do that. Oh my god, that was close. Alright, jump there, that's a conveyor, and do this. Final four of Citadel left us putting. I already know what to do there. Um, you gotta do this now. Oh, I fell here. Wait, does that teleport you to the conveyor part now? I think it does. Alright, we're back at this floor. And we just did that. Here's some half studs, so don't fall there. Alright, here's the conveyor. the second last floor again, I guess again.
All right, this part again. All right, I recommend staying at the corner until the second last spinner. Now. All right, final part again. All right, last jump. All right, looks like we won, guys, finally. Right at the last minute until one hour. Um. See you guys.